I'm Roger Greiner, and I'm a fourth generation syrup maker, and we've had a sugar bush or made maple syrup off of these trees for over a hundred years. Uh, we, near as we can tell, about 1890s when they started making syrup here. About two and a half years ago, Richard and Dave from the Iron Fish Distillery contacted us about an experiment of putting some maple syrup in whiskey barrels. And I says, gee, that sounds like a lot of fun. How much do you want? And they said, we'd like 45 gallons. And so I says, well, gosh, I can do that. And uh, we sent over 45 gallons of syrup. month period of time they were back and they brought me 53 gallon barrels and they asked me to fill those two of them 106 gallons of syrup nice little sale and they took that over and they started making this maple bourbon it was the second batch of this maple bourbon and uh, about the time we got to fill in the third kegs the first batch of maple bourbon was actually done and we got a chance to sample it and I knew right then that uh, this is where my sugar bush needed to go, is to spend most of my time producing for them so they could produce this maple bourbon. And we're up to five batches now, I think, and it's still as good as the first batch I tried. I don't think they'd let me do that when I was the first time sugar maker, but that's pretty good stuff right there. When I was a lot younger, I got to taste syrup, and now I get to taste something that's made from my syrup, and it's good.